Welcome to New London. I'm Elizabeth Durazio and I'm joined by Jim Culhane, the president and CEO of the Lake Centipede Region VNA and Hospice. And many of us have experienced their care firsthand with a loved one or a family member or friend, but they're looking for us to help them out in a unique way. Thank you for joining us, Jim. Oh, thanks for having me. I appreciate it. So you're here with a unique question for all of us is, do you want to work at a great place that makes a difference? That is an excellent way to put it. And mm -hmm. the answer is absolutely yes. Mm -hmm. You know, we work in a what we would consider a, a tricky labor market. We have a lot right. of great healthcare professionals in the area. However, the demand for those positions is higher than the supply. So as such, we are left looking to aggressively, as best as possible, hire the highest quality of individuals and create a work environment, a supportive culture that makes them want to work for us. And because we like it when people like to drive into their job, enjoying their jobs, basically. And that makes a better experience for both the patient in this case, because you really, well, you deal with in-home care, yeah. and you really need happy employees to be able to provide that level of customer service and you know clinical mm -hmm. care that they need. But also, in the medical field, it is so easy to get burned out. Yeah. It is so easy to get yeah. into the daily grind. It is so easy to you know do the best you can, but yeah. it becomes, you know in order to give the best care to your patient, it becomes dehumanizing to the professional. Mm -hmm. And I think what you're trying to explain to us is the changes and the improvements you're also making to an already great place to work for mm -hmm. is to maintain that human quality for the employees. That's exactly right. Yeah, we have a unique healthcare environment. We don't work in facilities per se, we don't mm -hmm. work in hospitals, we work in people's homes. However, over the years, the complexity and the acuity of the patients that we see are, are getting more and more, is getting greater. Right. Uh, people are leaving the hospitals earlier, they're leaving facilities earlier, and as such, the, the quantity and the quality of the care that we need to provide gets more and more, it gets higher and higher, basically. So we really strive to hire high quality staff and in order to retain them, because retention is very important, we we really have been putting a lot of energy, not only, uh, we've been doing this for some years, but I think we've really ramped up over the last 12, uh, probably six to 12 months. Mm -hmm. We've really wanted to invest a lot of energy and resources into the culture of the organization. Right. And a component of the culture of the organization is what are the staff supports we can put in? What are the resources we can put mm -hmm. in to make Lake Centipede VNA really the employer of choice in our area? And I, and I think if anyone out there right now is trying to decide what field to go into, or if they're advising their kids or their family mm -hmm. members or friends, or perhaps they're looking, where does something to do? Yeah. Healthcare is an amazing field to yeah. get into, and you can grow through it. You Absolutely. offer growth in your organization, too. This is not Absolutely. a dead-end position. Explain to us how, Absolutely. really, it benefits the employee to stay at the VNA. Absolutely, and, to, and to, uh, I guess to comment real quickly, if you want a job where you will never, ever be unemployed, at <laughs> least for the foreseeable future, nursing, physical therapy, yes. occupational therapy, speech therapy, a licensed nursing assistant or home health aide, uh, the demand far outweighs the supply. So those right. are wonderful careers to get into. So but coming back to your question in statement, which is, you know, we really want to invest in our employees and we've begun to focus on a number of different areas. And out of that came uh, really uh, what we call the Fund for Excellence. And mm -hmm. the Fund for Excellence is really a campaign that we have to really identify and invest uh, really resources into uh, the uh, our staff. Mm -hmm. We want to help get them licensed. We want to pursue certifications. We want to develop scholarship funds. We want to give them education opportunities. And that's a bit of a win-win. And the win-win right. is you raise their skill level, you add to their quality, and by doing so we raise the overall agency quality of care that we're able to provide in the community. So really getting your foot in the door with the Lake Sunapee Region VNA and hospice mm -hmm. isn't just a career choice. It really is a lifestyle choice because you're going to be able to grow with this organization. Yeah. You know you can start at the you know at the beginning at an LNA yeah. and maybe work your way through years from now into something even greater. That's right. And I think a lot of the, what we see from a career development begins with the flexibility that we have in working. We don't work like a, like a hospital, we don't have three 12 hour mm -hmm. shifts. We have flexible scheduling that allows us to offer staff a flexible uh, schedule for them to right. pick and choose the days based upon what they wanna do, but also what the needs of the organization are. And uh, that in conjunction with pursuing different certifications in education, such as wound care or IV certification or palliative care. Right. These are the areas that we feel are important to us that we help try to help people grow so they can expand, expand their knowledge set as well. So tell us a little bit about the annual summer party and fundraiser that everyone is talking about. Oh, I'm glad you brought it up. So our annual party is actually next Tuesday, which mm -hmm. is August 27th, which takes place at the New London Historical Society. Right. And for those who want to attend, because <laughs> a lot of people are welcome, yes. please contact Kathy Raymond. 
at that event, we are going to be continuing to highlight our Fund for Excellence campaign sure. because that's going to be a key area that we drive, not only at the event, but also with the remainder of 2019 and 2020, which really is focused on developing staff, culture, and supports. Sounds like a great idea. So if you'd like to check out the Lake Sunapee Region VNA and Hospice firsthand because you know someone or maybe you are looking for a way to get into the healthcare field with a job that matters in a human way, not only to your patients, but to yourself, check out the Lake Sunapee Region VNA and Hospice and their website for more information.